My name is Virginia Charlotte. I'm an EST student from the Lincoln Tech Union campus. Um, originally, I'm from Haiti. Um, I came here about 10 years ago. That's part of it. And I've been in Hillside since then. Funny story, I was on the internet just browsing and the, it just popped up. And I was like, okay, let me check it out. Then I, they, they immediately after like two to five minutes, somebody texted me and, and they're like, you, you can come and see the school. And I was like, okay. Next day I came over here and the, uh, the rev was showing me the school. And I was like, okay, I'll do that. Well, I was always fascinated with how electricity worked. And I, I didn't know there was actually a school that teach you different type of what you can learn when it comes to electri uh, electrical. So I was excited to find out about that. I like the motors class. I also like heavy with all the programming and I actually get to build my own rack. I love the fire alarm class. Yeah, we, it was, it was, I enjoyed myself in there. Learned different, let's just say I learned a lot of things in there. Then security class was also a good class to have. You know, the hands-on, I love doing the labs and contrib um, contributing with the students, follow what the instructors are saying, and when you finish, you get to see exactly what you were doing. So you get a sense of satisfaction of completing the lab. But it's a great opportunity to have. You learn a lot of stuff over here. It's, it's really amazing what you can do with what you learn. And it's also an, an option that you have, then you don't always have to go to that route. You can choose another different path and just follow your dreams. When I was on my first um, MAD, um, Ms. Sheris, Ms. Sheris Thomas, I don't know if you heard of her, she came to our classroom and she was talking about all of the options that we have after graduation and she, she uh, mentioned the FIT program. And I was fascinated by it. I stayed, I stayed like 15 minutes after school just asking her questions about what it was, what they do. Then a um, couple months after, after that, Mr. Kisten, he came over here and he showed us the PowerPoint and he said, if, if it's something you're interested, you can still, you can do it. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna give this a try. And here I am, passed the interview, the assessment, and now I'm going to Indianapolis. I am really excited. I was panicking with the testing and interview, but as, as soon as we get past that, you know, you get excited just to go over there and see what you're made of. The reason that I, um, that I take the FIP program, is, it's because there is a lot, lot more that I can learn over there. It's a, it's a great, great path, career path. I also have like fire alarm or AV or security, I could go into this too, but I still have more to learn when it comes to electricity or in mechanics, and it's a great opportunity to learn that over there. I feel really good about the education that I get at Lincoln Tech. Um, there is a lot of um, career path that you can take from all the, all the um, materials that we, we learned over here. One great thing about it was when I had my interview with the FPSA, um, the, I'm pretty sure it was the CEO, it was telling me that there is, there is um, all the materials that I learned from here, all the modules, there is also a part of it in the food industry with uh, networking, yeah, mostly everything. Because we still use the same materials that we learn over here also, over there. Today's my final, final day. A little sad, but excited. 
I'm so glad that I came here. One of the best, best choices I ever made. Well, to tell you the truth, I did not know that was that I was gonna be the first female to do it, but I'm really, really happy to hear that. I'm really happy, and a lot of more people, more females like my, my like myself, can actually do do that too. So it's great that I was the first person to do it and show other people, it can be males or females, that they can also do that too.